word of God tells us in Amos chapter 3 verse 7, For the Lord God does nothing without revealing his secrets to his servants the prophets. On Friday, the 19th of October 2018, God prophet Bishop C.B. Motondo gave a word of prophecy to the nation of Zimbabwe. Concerning the current economic challenges the nation is facing, the death of three prominent people in the nation, two top government officials and a well-known man of God. Because there is three there's three deaths, but one is sudden. The three deaths, but Jesus. one is sudden. Yes, one is a death that someone is not known as sick, but is gone. Jesus. But the sad part of it because he's a man of God. Jesus. The sad part of it because he's a man of God. Jesus. Lord help us. In Zimbabwe. He also went on to explain about some gunshots that will hit the nation and will cause a lot of confusion. Is that the gunshot that I'm hearing in the spirits? They can't find where it's coming from, but it's creating a lot of fear of people. That the Lord will bring people, this, He will expose these people, and they'll be caught in by their hands, exposed to the public. The God prophet Bishop C. B. Motondo gave specific details the time, the month, and the period in which all these events are going to happen, and that's where his words. Thank you, yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes. for your grace and your mercy. Jesus. I want us to pray because oh, pray last Sunday I wanted to release this prophecy. I was carried away and I could not release it. The reason why I called you because we need to pray for the country. I want us to pray for the country so that whatever the enemy is preparing in the spiritual atmosphere, it will not affect other people. There are so many things that is going on in the spirit right now. There are people who are gathering and using word in order to bring starvation. Confusion in the country. Jesus. There are people who are using money, you know, order to make others suffer. Jesus. And they are there. They are doing that deliberately. Jesus. Our prayer today is that God will expose every power of the enemy. Amen. God will try them. Amen. That everything they are putting together in order to fail the economy of this country. Jesus. God is going to dry their pockets yes. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. and this country will move forward. Yes, Jesus. The Lord said we should pray because there are people who are there. They are in this country. They are praying so that people will suffer. They are praying to collapse even this government. We are praying that whatever means they are using, God will dry it. Yes, Lord. That source that they are using to fight, God is going to dry it. Yes, Lord. And the economy of the country is going to advance. Yes, God will bring food in this country. Thank you, Jesus. Before December, God will silence them. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. 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 That's the first, the, the first one. The second one we must pray. Because there is three, there's three deaths, but one is sudden. The three deaths, but Jesus. one is sudden. Yes, one is a death that someone is not known as sick, but is gone. Jesus. But the sad part of it because he's a man of God. Jesus. The sad part of it because he's a man of God. In Zimbabwe, Jesus. dying a sudden death. Jesus. I see everybody talking about it. It's like a shock. People ask the question why, 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 why? We 
must pray. This November entering December is not a good month. In the spiritual atmosphere, something is going to happen exactly in the day that the new government took power. Something is going to happen. I see people, some celebrating Christmas. I see some on the Christmas day burying and crying. Jesus. Weeping and mourning. December, Christmas day, I see some celebrating and some die, some crying, mourning. November, the period that the new government entered, I see a clear bad news about top people top people in this government Thank you, Jesus. Do November Do in the same time I see news this BBC South Africa news Al Jazeera they are talking about the same events and the question people are raising, they say, why are it happens in the same time that what happened last year happened? I pray with this, I battle with this in this place. The Lord said, certain things have to happen so that people know that I'm God. But them that have here, they must hear. That God ways are not our ways. Yes. And God justice are not our justice. Yes. I see confusion starting from that very same date in November. Exactly the same date in November that the incident took place. December, I see confusion in the country. I see people talking all over. I see a lot of things happening that create a lot of confusion. Our prayer is now to pray that God peace will reign. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Because when I'm saying God peace will reign, because I have heard a bullet. I have heard gunshots. But people do not know where the gunshot is coming from. Jesus. He has created a lot of confusion. Jesus. Have mercy. We must go to prayer. We must go to prayer. November. 25th December I repeat the very same date in November the incident took place 25th December we have to go to prayer so I want you to lift up your voice now I pray first thing we have to pray we say God have mercy on your servants Whatever it is, God have mercy. But by the end of your prayer, I want to say, God, let that will be done. The second prayer you was made now is that God, peace must reign from November to December 25th. That whatever confusion the enemy is preparing, God peace and God will must prevail the last one to pray is that the gun shot that I'm hearing in the spirits they can't find where it's coming from but it's creating a lot of fear on people that the Lord will bring people this he will expose these people and they'll be caught in by their hand exposed to the public and the cause behind it shall be, re shall be re revealed. And I pray for the Almighty God. God of God. Not say again. 
that is the only prayer I'm praying. Because I see like a tree, very, very big giant, very big one, fall. He fall down. He very fall down. And I hear news all over. My prayer is that God will be in charge of everything. I don't want to mention a name for the reason of security because I see what I see. But let's the prophet speak and let the congregation hear and pray. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Open your mouth and begin to pray right now. The man of God, Bishop C.B. Motondo, told the church to pray about all these events. But he also made the church understand that some of these events, it is the will of God. So that people will know that he alone is God and he ought to be given glory. Father, we thank you because you are here. Jesus. And your presence are here. Jesus. And it's a time you said, Oh God, cry no more. For you have heard our cry. And you come to bless us. We thank you, God, for this good news. Yes. We thank you, God. Yes, Lord. By the word of a prophet. Yes, Lord. I made it again. Yes, Lord. By the word of a prophet. Yes, Lord. I made it again. Yes, Lord. Establish now. In the name of Jesus. Let your name be glorified. Bless every soul in this place. Jesus. Bless every individual people in this place. Bless every family in this place. Thank you, Lord. As we go home, oh Lord, go with us. Cover us by your blood. Bless your name. Jesus. Thank you, Lord. We lose your people from the bondage of the enemy. Yes. Jesus. And we speak the blood of Jesus. Yes. yes, Lord. As we go, you go with us. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' name. When the God's servants speak, the wise who listen.